Hi, this is Cammie. Welcome or welcome back to my luxury channel where I never edit or worry about fancy thumbnails or lighting or fancy equipment. You kind of get what you get when you hair, hear, hair, hair, sit, see, no, that's going to be in the video. <laughs> and I'm looking down at a paper because my new intro, I just can't memorize. Anyway, I wanted to come on here today. Um, forgive me if the hair looks really flat and just out of sorts. I've been dealing with a sinus infection the last few days and vertigo unrelated to the sinus infection. Um, I deal with BPPV, if anybody knows what that is, um, give it a shout out. So I didn't go get my hair washed and blown out this um, past weekend. Actually, today is Monday. I usually go every weekend to get my hair blown out. I didn't do it because I can't lay back and have my head washed and whatever. So I did it myself, and this is what it looks like. And this took a half hour. <laughs> it's just, it's horrible. Anyway, I wanted to come on and give you, um, show you my entire suede handbag collection somebody requested it so i love when people request videos and i like to oblige so um it's really not going to be that long because i really only have one two three four um five that's it five i love suede if you've been following my channel you'll know that but you know what it's not the most durable it doesn't hold up the best so for me to like spend obscene money on a suede bag I'm not going to go there, um, but it's all relative to you know what people think is obscene money. Some people won't spend $100 on a suede bag or any bag that's not that durable. Um, and some people say, okay, my limit is I'm not going to go over $500 for a suede bag or $800 for a suede bag. You know, it all depends on what your budget is. So anyway, let's get started right now with the bag that I'm using today. I just changed into it, and it is, if I don't drop it on the floor, my mini mailbox in brown leather and suede. Now you'll know that my coloring, my lighting is not all that great, so hopefully you're gonna get a good idea of what the bags look like. Um, I'm trying, it's not so sunny out, so you know, that, that affects my, my video. So this is the brown leather and suede. The sides are suede. The trimming and the patch is leather, and the bottom is leather which is smart, smart of Long Chomp to do that. Um, it holds all um, full size items. Like I have my YSL key pouch with my keys in there. I have my zippy wallet. I have my little pouch with hand sanitizer and my lip balm. I have my mini readers and it could hold probably, oh, um, yeah, that's it. It could hold a ton more. I highly recommend these mini, with the paper all over the place, so. <laughs> I highly recommend the mini Long Chomp mailbox. I don't know if they're making them anymore, but if you can get it pre-owned, this bag is beautiful. I love it. Gold hardware, nothing looks more beautiful than brown with gold hardware. I love it. It has a crossbody strap which is not adjustable. That's the only downfall. And it does have, I will say it has a wide, um, a deep profile. So when you wear it, the way it lays, I'm gonna show you real quick so you know, but it's not a deal breaker for me. I love the bags. That's why I have, th how many do I have? I have like three. It sticks out a little bit here, but not terrible, and it's not uncomfortable. It hasn't been, and I wear them frequently. Okay, next, same bag in orange. Absolutely stunning. It's a true orange. It's called Marmalade. Um, I'm not going to take the strap out, but again, same as the brown one. I 
I absolutely love orange suede. Um, and orange with gold hardware looks stunning. That's why I bought the, um, if you've been following me, you know that I also have a very similar size, shape, bag in all leather orange from Jimmy Choo. That's absolutely gorgeous. So yeah, this is my other suede and leather bag from Long Chomp. And you can see the light when I put the um, bag up close. You see flashing on my screen. Yes, because the lighting, <laughs> because the lighting isn't that good. So when I move this closer, it shadows and it makes the screen flash. But I'm trying to get a good, you know, show you the real color of this. And it's hard to tell. Sorry. <laughs> Yeah, one day I will buy a new computer and I will, I will invest and make, I don't know, better videos, or maybe not. You saw this recently. Um, I actually showed my winter, what I felt was my most used winter bags, and I think these were on there. So you're kind of seeing them again, but I appreciate you watching anyway if you saw that video. Chloe, small saddle, Marcy in the blue suede, gorgeous, 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 gorgeous color. I love Chloe. I've always been a fan. It's absolutely beautiful. It's leather on the inside here. It holds a lot. It holds my phone. This is the uh, six, 7 Plus. The phone goes right in, just showing you if you're interested in the Marcy small saddle. Phone goes right in with plenty of room to spare. It's a great bag. I have it also in shirling and tan um, leather, which I showed on my other video. I think I'll link that video below, the um, most used winter bags I just did that collection so this is pretty much the same but I'll link that because that had a couple of other bags in it that you might be interested in seeing so here is the uh, yeah suede this um, strap does not come off but it is adjustable I love this bag it's beautiful 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 and second to last if you looked at my thumbnail my Dooney. You saw this on my most used winter, although I don't use this <laughs> that often, but I feel like it's a winter fall bag because it's black all suede. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. It's the mini Barlow. Feet on the bottom. It's absolutely gorgeous. I know you can't tell what this black suede looks like, but in person, it is so rich looking and like 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 velvet. It's just absolutely stunning. Absolutely stunning. I said second to last because my thumbnail, you saw that I have um, an old school coach um, dust bag. So I wanted to stick that in just for the hell of it because it's really a cool bag. So anyway, so this is my uh, Dooney Mini Barlow in black suede and black leather trim. I absolutely love this bag. I think I only wore it once. I don't know why, because it's gorgeous. It's still stuffed the, the way it came. I wore it once. I always restuff my bags. And I love this bag. I love it. Every time I look at it, like I try to see, like, should I get rid of some bags, move on, make room? And every time I look at this, I'm like, nope, it's not going anywhere. It's absolutely gorgeous. And last but not least, I will show you this because it has suede on it. It's not full suede, but for all you mature women and men out there that are old school and remember the days of Coach, when they did their patchwork collection. This is, I don't remember the name, sorry about the noise, but this coach bag, it's suede on the bottom with feet, 
suede on the sides. It has patchwork of the signature, you know, canvas. It has gold leather. Um, other than the structure, and I wore this bag a lot. I got this one and I got the denim blue looking one, same shape and everything, back when they were first launched. I mean, it's got to be 15, 20 years. I don't even know. If someone knows when these bags were first out, let me know. Other than the structure, you see it's a mess because I didn't have it stuffed and I should have it. I should stuff it. Other than the structure, there's not a mark on this bag. And I wore it a lot. I mean, if I take a, a, a jeweler's loop and look on the hardware, maybe I could find a scratch here or there. I don't know. Absolutely gorgeous. I will never get rid of this bag. I love this bag. I would use this bag. And look, 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 the front pocket. You fit your phone right in there. <laughs> I mean, they, they don't just, they don't make bags like this anymore. I love this bag. Even the, I mean, the, the trimming, there's like, there's nothing. There's nothing. The trimming is like nearly perfect. Nothing, not a scratch. Maybe, maybe a little bit over here on the gold leather. There might be a scuff, a one or two scuffs. It's, it's amazing how this bag held up. And like I said, not stored very well because you can see the structure. It's just kind of hanging in the dust bag on a coat tree. I know it shouldn't be there, but... Anyway, so I just wanted to share this blast from the past. Anyway, don't mind the running water. Again, this is a channel that doesn't edit and doesn't have fancy equipment. Whatever happens, happens. So that's my son washing his glasses in the sink. He's about to go to the gym. So I will just say until the next video, I do have some things on the way. I might even be adding a new suede bag to my suede bag collection. I might be. So please subscribe, hit that subscribe button and the bell notification so you know when I post videos and come back. I'm trying to reach 2000. I mean, this is like a crawl, literally crawl for me, trying to reach 2000 and I'm just crawling along. <laughs> so, you know, tell your friends about me, tell your family about me, just put my channel on and let it run when you're doing laundry or the dishes. Why not? <laughs> anyway, have a great day and I will see you guys soon. Bye.